October for Beyblade X is going to be crazy. It looks like they've got a bunch of new stuff that's supposed to be coming out soon. We've got a new starter. We've got a new random booster volume. We've got the battle entry set and it looks like a string launcher as well. Let's go ahead and take a look at each of the new products. So first off, we've got Leon Claw. Now I'm not gonna lie, Leon Claw is looking really dope, looking really cool. The overall design aspect of this bay, I think is just super sick. The gold on black, and then the blade itself, we've got this like five pointed kind of claw like design, and I'm really digging the way it's looking right now. Leon Claw also comes with a launcher, and the winder launcher is looking super dope. We've got this white on gold type ripcord going on white on gold but the black on gold i mean you can't go wrong with that kind of now noticing this too but we've got like a red bit does it seem like right here this part does it seem like that is a little closer to this than it should be are we gonna start getting five point ratchets with this uh leon claw yeah so it looks like we are getting five point ratchets leon claw 560p really interesting that they're doing a five point i've been kind of waiting to see if they were going to start doing different you know different ratchet designs and shapes so that's really cool let's move on to the next we've got viper tail definitely an interesting looking addition to the beyblade x family you can kind of see a little bit of like a tail like design going on i kind of like the way it looks I'm also noticing these little hexagon patterns going on the inner part of the plastic. So if they start doing, you know, more design and more like detailed uh, design aspects with them, that that's really going to be cool to see how they evolve over time. That's Viper Tail, random booster. Next up, let's go ahead and check out the battle entry set, BX-17. So with this new battle entry set, it looks like we're getting a new stadium with a black interior and the green ridge I, I think that it's cool that they're keeping that green ridge because personally for me I like to use it for green screen effects and a black stadium as the background for the green screen ridge that's pretty sick looks like we also get a recolor of drawn sword like a deep blood red recolor of drawn sword and I'm kind of liking that we're also getting a recolor of wizard arrow it's kind of cool to see that they're doing a blue one uh, also we get recolors of the winder launchers this red launcher to be paired with drawn sword and this blue launcher to be paired with wizard arrow really liking that they're doing some extra colors you know the new launchers are really sick and they work really well and it's just nice to see some new colors you know we got the red we got the blue overall really cool that they're doing all that last but not least we're getting this black string launcher it's really nice that they're adding uh, another color for the string launchers i will be honest it would have been cool to see a different color but at least people who want a string launcher can buy a string launcher at a decent price instead of having to go and get the uh, start dash set which is the only other string launcher right now it's nice that they're releasing this one so that that opens up the string launchers to everybody who doesn't want to have to shell out you know more than a hundred dollars for a stadium set really cool that they're doing that you know it'd be really nice to see them kind of improve on the string launcher and add more colors add more stuff to it we'll just have to see kind of how that evolves over time but right now you know since it's at the beginning i can kind of just i can i can understand them kind of starting basic super excited about all these releases we've got leon claw we've got viper tail battle entry set and another string launcher I, it just keeps getting better and better and honestly i'm just really excited to see what else they keep releasing personally for me i i think i'm the most excited right now for leon claw i really love this shape i really love that they're bringing in a five point ratchet the bit i'm curious to see a bit more about that um it looks like just a regular flat bit p i don't know what p means maybe it's that particular type of plastic that has like really low friction i know they've used that type of plastic for different beyblades for beyblade burst so maybe it's you know has less friction and allows it to spin longer for it being a flat bit i i don't know we'll just have to see a bit more information when more stuff gets released 
But overall, like I said, I seriously love the colors. I seriously love the shape and design. That's everything that's releasing in October. Let me know what you all think about all these new releases that are coming out. And let me know if you're excited about Leon Claw or if you're looking more so forward to uh, Viper Tail. Because personally for me, I think they both look amazing. I'm looking forward to both of them. But I know some people are going to lean to one or the other. And it's totally understandable. I just think all all these look really cool but yeah thank you all for sticking around thank you all for watching other than that have a great rest of your day and peace